That's right. So far, more than $790,000 has been raised. And like we just mentioned, it's one of the busiest times of the year for bars and restaurants. That's a good thing for Robert Morse University because one of these bars behind me, well, proceeds from all their tabs are going to their campaign. We've got a short amount of time to reach our goal. The magic number is $1.4 million. With less than a month to go, it's the final push to reinstate the Division I men's and women's ice hockey programs at Robert Morse University. Pittsburgh's a hockey town, so when this happened, it was like we can't have a hockey town without a college hockey team. <laughs> Former U.S. Olympian and Robert Morse alum Brian McLaughlin Biddle came out to show her support at the Pittsburgh College Hockey Thanksgiving gathering. People packed All-Star Sports Bar and Grill in Robinson for the fundraiser. The night before Thanksgiving, last year we had to be closed early. And to kick it off with this event, you know, for the holiday season is wonderful. Sports is what bring people together. I mean, you got the fans, the alumni, they come back. It's what it's all about. Back in May, the university discontinued the men's and women's teams due to lack of funding. That's when the Pittsburgh College Hockey Foundation and RMU teamed up with the hopes of bringing back hockey. It's pretty gratifying to me. I mean, I've always been a hockey fan, and just to see people come out and have a genuine interest in, you know, getting the team back. Now on this Thanksgiving Eve, as people come out and celebrate, the goal is so close. I ended up playing in two Olympics, but my childhood dream was to play Division One hockey. So Robert Morris gave me that dream back in 2005, and I think I've been more connected to this place than I ever thought that I would be. Now, in order to reinstate these programs in time for the 2022-2023 hockey season, they must raise $1.4 million by December 15th. Reporting live in Robinson tonight, Ashley Zoka, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. Ash